There's been ongoing speculation about Samsung's release plans for One UI 7.0, but the company's tentative roadmap for the beta program may now be taking shape. Here's what the One UI 7.0 release program reportedly looks like. Galaxy S24 Expected to receive the first public beta build in the first week of December, though availability will be region-specific. Galaxy S23 series, likely to join the beta phase two to three weeks later. Beta duration, the testing phase may last around two months, with the stable build expected to roll out in February 2024. Galaxy S22 series, may or may not be included in the beta program. Galaxy S21 series, reportedly will not have access to the beta program. As always, beta schedules are subject to change until officially announced. Special thanks to at Family Taze for sharing this insight. When someone asked if the Galaxy S25 would launch with One UI 7, the source replied that it would likely launch with One UI 7.1. They also mentioned that the late beta for One UI 7 shouldn't affect the Galaxy S25's development much. It's worth noting that the list of devices mentioned earlier is non-exhaustive. The One UI 7.0 beta program may also expand to include select foldable devices at some point. The beta program is expected to last about two months, with the final stable release likely rolling out in February. This timing aligns with the Galaxy S25 series launch as Samsung has confirmed that One UI 7 will debut on the S25 lineup and won't be available on any other device beforehand. While Chinese competitors are rolling out stable Android 15 updates at a rapid pace, Samsung seems to be falling behind. The Korean tech giant has yet to release the first beta of One UI 7, based on Android 15, to any of its devices. This marks a noticeable slowdown compared to the impressive update speed Samsung has maintained in recent years. New details about One UI 7's animations and transitions have surfaced. Tipster Ice Universe has shared some detailed insights into the animations and transitions featured in One UI 7.0. According to him, the screen on animations is soothing wallpaper shrinking effect. The unlocking animation is a bouncing effect. The pull down animation adds a spring rebound animation. The desktop app opening animation adds a more non linear floating feeling. The desktop app return animation adds an icon pattern zoom effect. Add a parallel animation for opening multiple apps continuously. Add a full animation for sliding the app sideways to return to the desktop. In the settings, click any button to add a press rebound micro animation and a new return animation effect. Add transition animations and new UI for widgets, such as lock screen music. Add elastic animations for real-time notifications in the desktop notification bar. More to be explored. It is expected that after the beta is released, new animations will be adjusted and added based on the feedback from internal test users. Please accurately feedback problems and suggestions at that time. The One UI 7.0 beta will initially roll out to the Galaxy S24 series in South Korea and the USA. A few days later, countries like China, Germany, Poland, and the UK may also receive the update. Without sharing the video, the leaker revealed detailed information about the animation improvements in One UI 7. The upcoming update is expected to introduce a fresh and dynamic experience for Galaxy users with significant transitional enhancements throughout the software. I hope you liked the video. If you enjoyed the video, subscribing to the channel would be greatly appreciated. That's it for today. What's your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comment section. As always, see you in the next video. Peace out.